What's up to whoever might be watching? My name's Justine. Today's video, we are going to be listening to the full project with Scar Lord and Cordell. The project is called Psycho. There is 10 songs for a total of 23 minutes. Songs that I have reacted to already on my channel are Like You Would Know, and Miss Me. So there's eight other songs that I have not heard yet. I really, really enjoyed the last two tracks that I heard with Scarlord and Cordell. They've obviously proven to be a really good duo, so I'm excited to hop into this album and really just listen to more and just see what else that they have created together. Let's just hop right on in with Killing the Surface. What I really have been liking about these Cordell produced songs is I feel like we're seeing a bit of a different side of Scar Lord. Then again, there is a lot of music of his that I haven't heard, so maybe that's just like my personal experience. But I just feel like the sounds and the approaches that they've been creating together have really like surprised me. I feel alive. beat is like very very dancey and normally that wouldn't like straight up be my style but I feel like the way that they come together with it I like it. Made in Hell part one. <laughs> of EDM like 
style in that. Personally, I just have never really been a fan of EDM music or like rave culture or any of that stuff. It's not really my thing, but I am trying to listen to this with an open mind and not just like immediately shut it down in my mind it's good it's just not my style so like i can see why others would like it it's just like doesn't do a whole lot for me personally but i still want to continue to listen with open ears this is my life <laughs> So far, out of the ones that I listened to on this video, not talking about the other ones, This Is My Life is my favorite so far. So many different elements going into that track. It was done very, very well. Now we got I'm the Devil. I like that one a lot too. I, I don't even I don't, I don't even know how to say this next one, but the one that's after I'm the devil. I go along it's just getting better and better and better oh there's just really like a lot going on that track was very unique i really enjoyed that one as well too now we got find yourself <laughs> like what Scarlord was doing with his voice on this one. He was doing a bit different 
sounds and like techniques with it. Last one that we're going to listen to because the last song is one that we actually already heard. So we have Made in Hell part two. beat is so much more up my alley. I would definitely take a trap style beat over like an EDM type beat any day. So that is definitely more my style. Okay, wow. So that was the eight songs. A bit of a shorter project, but still a good one nonetheless. I know Cordell has been really blowing up in like the funk beats in that style. So it was nice to see them come together and create a tape together because it really is cool to see two different styles blend together and what they can create together. Most of these songs I really, really enjoyed. I think they came together well. I think they blended together well. It was nice to hear both of them kind of meet in the middle with doing some different styles. The project had a lot of diversity on it, like different sounds, different styles. It was honestly really fun to listen to. I never really knew what I was going to get. This was a great move for Scarlord because I think sometimes the criticism that he can get from people is that his songs sound all the same or they're too similar, whatever. And I feel like this was a good opportunity to really hop on some different types of beats and really collaborate with someone and just come up with something new and refreshing and I really really enjoyed this. This project showed both artists strengths and versatility. You guys definitely have to let me know what you thought of the project down below in the comments. Let me know which ones were your favorites, which ones you didn't like. Well that is pretty much it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one.